It's been more than a week since a man was killed in a fatal hit and run near 21st and National. The driver responsible is still on the run. Fox 6's Angelica Sanchez spoke with the victim's brother, who is pleading with the community to step up and turn the person in who is responsible. Angelica? That's right, Brett. The victim's brother wants the community to take a good look at suspect vehicle images that were released just this week. He wants people to look at these images closely. He says he and his family are desperately in need of closure. It's just a, a empty feeling, right? And it's an empty feeling his kids will have forever. There are no right words to describe what Michael House and his loved ones have been going through. His brother Caleb, a father of four, was killed in a fatal hit and run on October 6th. My brother was, was innocent in all this. Caleb was walking near 21st and National when he was hit by a suspect vehicle being chased by the West Dallas Police Department. The suspect driver kept going and has been on the run since. Authorities have released new images of the vehicle, while Crime Stoppers is now offering a $2,000 reward. The car color, it's a silverish tan, uh, major damage to the front end, into, into the one of the side mirrors is missing. Michael is asking anyone with home security cameras living near 80th and National to check their footage. This is where the chase began. He's hoping someone will have clear images of the suspect car. If you have something, you know, you might have that car in that area. Michael says the number of hit and runs that have unfolded in the city and surrounding suburbs since last week disturbs him. He says local politicians need to do more. It gets worse and worse and worse. He is asking the public to have a heart. If you don't catch this person, now you set a precedent. He pleads that anyone with information on the person responsible speak up and call police. For closure for his kids when they get older to know that this guy is still not roaming free. The West Dallas Police Department is in charge of this investigation. A funeral is scheduled for next Saturday. Live in Milwaukee, Angelica Sanchez, Fox 6 News. Well, hopefully someone comes forward. Angelica, thank you.